what is up bro gamers and welcome to Prismata Early Access Alpha. Now, this game is made and published and developed by Lunark Studios, so shout out to them for letting me play their game. And it actually drops today on March 8th. And they emailed me weeks ago on letting me try out their game. And of course, why wouldn't I accept? I accepted, and here I am making this video for them. And as you can see, again, there's a bunch of people already making videos and streams about it. Life Coach 1981 with a thousand viewers. I wish I could get that amount of viewers. Only the most I can get is like 10 on Twitch, <laughs> sadly. But to me, that's a lot, if you ask me. And then there's Crash Overlord with roughly 60 viewers, not as much as Life Coach. But yep, Prismata still in alpha, early access. Again, thank you, Lunar Studios, for letting me try out your game. Uh, I'm going to be playing through the campaign one hour long six no, what places blitz brawl event begins in 10 minutes received at 149 what the dang it well I'm gonna do the campaign right now a 30 minute overview of the campaign and yes I moved my face cam to the uh, lower left corner and it, it looks really weird to me if you ask me I, I I don't know holy crap I really do need a haircut uh it's it's getting out of hand now my hair shit Look, I need a, I need a thumbnail. Da, there, that'll do for the thumbnail, something like that. But yeah, I moved my face cam since uh, I guess my logo was blocking the face cam. Uh, the money maker, aka quote on the Miz from WWE on that, the money maker. But I really need to cut it, get a haircut, and start shaving everything, etc., etc., off my face. Blah, blah blah. It's getting a little bothersome now. But yeah, Prismata. Uh, is a strategy almost sort of like a card game if you think about uh, let's see hearthstone something like that but again a little mix with rts and strategy in there and uh there were a few reviews already and let me quote one for pc gamer actually everyone knows pc gamer if you're a pc gamer i'm a pc gamer you're a pc gamer what are you using the pc of course prismata isn't quite a card game and isn't quite an rts but it, at a certain point i stopped trying to label it and just wanted to keep playing now I did go through the first campaign mission on my own just to you know see how the game feels you know get a good feel about it how it plays out and I agree with PC gamer there after that it kind of got addicting uh, I just for some reason I don't know I just want to kept I wanted to keep going so I'm gonna be doing a 30 minute overview campaign of Prismata again thank you Lunar Studios and I've been doing a lot of promotional games now on my channel again John Mambo recently with uh, I forgot uh, it's in something games something like that I apologize but John Mambo uh, the first one I ever did was with uh, drop zone from Game Forge I think and I enjoyed that I definitely enjoyed and had a lot of fun playing John Mambo but now it's Prismata's turn again very addicting the first mission so Let's just get straight into it, campaign, and my password, uh, okay, you guys can't see that. Again, early access for me, of course, so I get all the goodies right now, show you guys what's up, and it says that I can upload the game, embargo or something like that, after 5 p.m. Toronto GMT, Greenwich Mean Time. Now, I know what Greenwich Mean Time is, but I don't use the Greenwich Mean Time, and I don't know how that kind of transcends or goes into the Eastern Standard Time of Toronto, Canada, or even, again, the East Coast here where I live, so I'm just going to upload a video right after 5 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, and uh, hopefully it's not 10 p.m. Eastern Standard Time for the Greenwich Mean Time. I might have gotten myself confused, but you guys can uh, tell me about it or whatever the heck it is. So, Outbreak Episode 1. Yes, as you can see, Junkers, that was the first campaign mission. I already went through it. Again, after that, I just wanted to keep going, but I had to save the rest of this for a YouTube video, and I'll probably stream this as well tomorrow. Tomorrow is also Empire Fridays, by the way, so you guys can show me your empires of Supreme Ruler, Hearts of Iron, Europa, whatever RTS game you have. I will stream it. You stream it through the Steam broadcast, and so on and so forth. So I can't wait for that tomorrow, guys. Again, Fridays are now Empire Fridays. Head straight into it. Expert challenge. Complete episode one to unlock expert difficulty. Well, whatever. I completed episode one. Beacon. 
a tidally locked planet. One half away always faces the sun, receiving constant daylight. The other side remains in perpetual darkness. And then you click there. And uh, almost like a visual, an anime visual novel game as well. Again, I gotta read over and whatnot. That's how it almost goes. But again, a card game, almost like a card game, RTS game, strategy game. It's an indie game as well included, if you want to call it that. That is why I'm showing you guys Prismata right now, if you are interested. Again, the game will be available today. Early access. Centauri, Solar Power Generation Outpost. Municipal Security Headquarters, Ministry District Century 1. Swade. Giselle, any work for me today? Swade Wong, Guardian Swarm Wielder. Employer, Municipality of Centauri, Department of Security Enforcement, Terrestrial Genomic Ancestry. 47% East Asian, 23% Iberian, 17% Eastern European. 5% North African, 8% other. One hour long. Oh, I didn't get a chance to read that. Hello, Swade. What the? Well, <laughs> of course, no voiceovers. I don't know if that's going to happen, like, in the future, but we'll see. No voiceovers. Uh, so Giselle is an AI. Okay, gotcha. She looks like something from iRobot. <laughs> Insentient Robotic Assistant Manufacturer of Fossics. Mechat Intelligence. Holy crap, man. Systems Incorporated. Roxas Deep Assist 2.8.27. Not using Android version. Something, something. Because Android versions I don't like. I don't like Android iOS. I prefer Apple. Install modules. Office Administrative Maintenance. Data Intelligence Worm Wielding Assistance. And my job continues to bring me endless excitement, fulfillment, and purpose. I'll be at the bar. Logan. Suede. We got Logan here. What the hell does he have in his hand? Dude, I gotta give me one of those. Centauri department, the same thing. Terrestrial genomic, 52% Northwest European, 24% Native American. How rare is that? 10% South Asian, 5% Sub-Saharan Africa, 9% other. Dude, these guys, all these genes, man, like, holy crap. They mix up a lot. <laughs> My contract allows remote work. It's not that. There's a situation down at Centauri. Uh... Shit, robotics factory. Okay, you know what? The face cam actually is kind of blocking uh, the bottom left corner there while I'm trying to read. So I guess I got to move it again. But I really liked it where it was before the bottom right corner. It fits every face cam right there. I told them last time we aren't responsible for parking disputes. No, we just received an incident report. Code red. Apparently one of the robo custodians pushed a foreman over a three-story catwalk railing. That can't be right. It's probably another jumper. Two witnesses called it in. You need to check it out. Now, pronto, ASAP, go. <laughs> Hasta la vista. All right, at least it's on the way to the bar. Speaking of which, I forgot to mention, check it out, guys. I just ordered these two amazing anime stickers from uh, moonwave.com. You can check them out on Instagram as well. Uh, they're stickers, gloss stickers, actually. Just peel them out, and you can put them anywhere on your PC, on your door, I guess, on your car, especially, uh, on your dresser. On your TV, not on your wall. I won't do that. But you can put it anywhere and uh, do their amazing. I haven't peeled them off because, again, I don't know where to put them yet. <laughs> uh, I want to put them in the car, but my brother says no because, of course, it's his car. It's not my car. I don't have a car. <laughs> you guys don't know that about me, but yes, I don't have a car. My brother is the only one that has a car because I'm trying to save a lot of money to go to Japan. And if I buy a car, you know, I got to pay all that crap off, credit, whatever. And then there goes all the money to go to Japan and next year or probably in 2020 as early as 2020 so it's either japan or the car and i chose japan so a car has to wait so yeah uh can't put these in the car but you guys can vote on the youtube polls which is the trap which is the trap hideri or rory which is the trap uh <laughs> uh is it the left one or is it the right one is this the right or is this the left i'm getting myself confused this is the left this is the right there we go all right so uh yeah Moonwave, you can check them out on Instagram. Lovely. All right. <clears throat> Six minutes later, I got the cool glasses. I got the cool shades on my on my face now. I'm here. Where's the casualty? Did they already strape them off the pavement? Yeah, I can't read that almost right there. The stupid face cam. God damn, my hair's a mess. I just took a shower too. The victim's barely alive. They took him into the emergency care. Apparently, a whole batch of robots went crazy. People are evacuating. Can't the supervisor just turn them off? They've tried everything. 
The bots are completely ignoring override and shut down demands. You need to terminate them. Terminator, huh? Terminator mode activated. Most action I've had on the job in months. Got your Prismata slate? Yep, it's right here. Let's see if this thing still works. Alrighty, here comes the action, guys. Again, as you can see, kind of resembles almost Hearthstone with some kind of card game or even the Yu-Gi-Oh card games uh, on PC if you ever tried them out. Uh, but again, it's almost trying to be like an RTS and strategy game. Alright, so let's see. The assembler creates a steep lifter, as you can see. Then you end your turn right there. Boom. Each steel splitter contributes one point of damage to attack pool. Damage is dealt at the end of each turn. Of course, some cards do much more damage. You got different perks in there. Defense. Uh, again, special weapons, special cards in there. And then, of course, you can proceed to damage. And then attack the other AI or human player. You proceed to damage. And then just choose one. Damage and turn right there. Again, almost like Yu-Gi-Oh! Almost like Heart of Stone. Something like that. Alright, so do this again. And you can, of course, that's why that, I love that. I really love how you can just drag across the screen and select multiple cards. That's what I love and that's what kind of got me addicted right now. It's so satisfying trying to do that and then slide it again across the screen, boom, took out two of them. Alright, do it again. You get more of course, slide three, tag damage three now, took them all out in turn. See how satisfying easy that is? What the fuck? That's what we need. More of that, please. Heck yeah, Lunark Studios. Heck yeah. Actually, there are quite a few more for you to take out. And by the way, guys, again, there's a link below to their uh, to their game on Steam. Again, it's going to be available on Steam as early access. There are quite a few more. Would you take out? Ouch. Looks like somebody at Centauri Robotics is getting... Dang it. Uh, I need to put my hair there because it's dark. So Just so I can read the white text. Uh, the text. Fired. There we go. See? That's the problem. I gotta really move the face cam. That is kind of screwing up things now. While I'm trying to read. Not sure yet. They're still looking into it, but it booted up a second assembler for you. Nice. That should speed things up. Alright. Repeat again. Assemblers. And again, as it tells you right there, you can drag across, swipe them all, proceed to damage. Then you can do it here. Boom. Took out forward. Reload. Again. Boom. Take out these guys, or just one of them, actually. Because that's four, actually. A scrapper. And then I can take two more of those litter bugs. Begin assembler. Uh -huh, uh -huh, uh -huh. And then take them all out. Boom. Satisfying. Centauri Robotics just updated me. Everything built in the last 40 hours has been corrupted. That's a lot of junkers. Do they want me to scrap them all? It's the only option. Want me to send over the Odin? It's still assembled in the hangar. The Odin? That level of firepower is total overkill for this. Send it over. Let me do it. Alright. Acting over the striker for that steel splitter to deal 4 damage. 14 damage. Look at that. So we'll take 2 of these dumpster bots out first. Alright. Do it again. 15 damage now. Take out all the little bugs and take 2 scrappers here. I know my math. Thank goodness. Do it again. Boom. And turn. Boom. So there's a further complication. Centauri robots can't stop the production line. The whole factory went nuts. Correct, it's pumping out corrupt scrappers at maximum speed. The factory computers are rejecting all commands, so they can't even power it down. They need to shut it off by force. Tell them it won't be a problem. Let's get this over with, shall we? Do it again, Odin. All steel. Splitters. Two dumpster bots. Attack. Oh, and I can take three more little bugs over there. I gotta take the bot factory, which is 20. Alright, there we go. I can't do it yet. There, take all the scrappers and little bugs out in an instant. Assemblers, Odin. I only have 19 right now, so I can't do that much right now against the bot factory. Take two of those. Can I do it now? 20 damage. Take the bot factory now. 20, there we go. Guys, isn't this addicting just watch just scrolling across, you know, swiping it like a phone right there. Just the touch screen of a phone right there with your mouse. That's what it feels like right now. And I took them all out. 
victory. Oh man, continue. Yep. Again, I already level up to level two there. Swade, what did you do? I destroyed it. What do you think I did, Logan? Just decommissioned a corporate soup can factory. I guess that was pretty compared to fighting in the war, huh? Nothing compares to that. The slate interface was so primitive back then you had to individually control every unit in the swarm. Now you just point and click. Just point and click. Like what I'm doing right now. Yeah, about that. We need to have a talk. If you want to talk, you know where to meet me. Alright, square wave. Here we go. Play. And this is where I kind of stopped again. Oh, we're at the bar now. Swade did want to go to the bar, so finally we made it to the bar. Swade. Finally. Took off his shirt. <laughs> oh, look at that face. Oh my goodness. I'm sorry. But he kind of looks like Caesar from uh, Planet of the Apes. Everyone's watched the movies, amazing movies, if you haven't watched it, all three of them. But I'm sorry, but with that beard, everything, his facial hair, he kind of looks like Caesar. Look at all that messed up hair. I mean, my hair, my hair is kind of messed up too. But holy shit, dude. Mine's goes to one side. His is going all over the place. <laughs> what a massacre. They don't even have enough junkers to... Uh, to overhaul away the carcasses. God, okay, you know what? Now I'm here. I should have made fun. Fuck. Hair's messing me up. It's a good thing you were gentle when you shut down the factory. Of course, I employed the utmost surgical precision when I violently demolished the place. Uh, so, about that. Back at the factory, you seemed a bit rusty with the swarm wielding interface. Oh, well, yeah, says who? Says the built in anas analysis software. It also says that your continuing education, Logan, hasn't been. Used in 455 days. I was called in to handle some robots and I handled them. Lust. Just leave it at that. Okay, that face cam is really bomb. I've said that a hundred times, but uh, Mr. Peace Guy, I think you were the one that said it. Just noticed it finally. Uh, for uh, visual novel games like this, when I'm trying to read the text, I think I'm going to have to move it over there to the bottom right instead of the bottom left. So. For other games, I'll probably just keep it here. But you used the love training and practicing. Back when it mattered, the war is over, Logan. Being a swarm wielder feels pointless when there's no one to fight. Well, what about the tournaments? The tournaments were great back when it took real skill to win them. Well, shouldn't you at least try to pass simulations? Screw the sims, give me some real action. And you'll see now how it's done. <laughs> Gentlemen, apologies for the interruption. Wow, just sell your volume the dress code. Huh? You can't come square without your pants on? Wait, what? What? I determined that pants were of low priority. But Giselle, the AI, doesn't even have hair. You should at least give her some hair or something, you know? We received another urgent incident report. More hostile sanitation automatrons. Or automatons were sighted in unknown or downtown Centauri. They're damaging vehicles. What? How is that even possible? Did we miss some of them? You look into it. I'm heading out there. I'll take a swarm of drones this time. Back into the action for Swade. Alright. So, drones again. Boom. Each drone produces one gold per turn. Again, you're going to have all these items down here. You got energy. What else? Damage attacks, of course. Gold, etc., etc. Blast force. Start of game. And turn. Each blast force produces one bohemium per turn. So I've got four gold. Yeah. All right. I could take a steel splitter. I'll take a steel splitter. And turn. All right. Activate drones to get gold. Blast force produces one. I forgot what that shit was called. <laughs> Blue. Lapis Lazuli. Everyone knows that from Minecraft. Lapis Lazuli. Use users to buy more units. Uh, Bohemium. Alright, so Bohemium. Let's do this again. Attack. Proceed to damage. Oh, spend your resources before you're completing. Oh, I didn't see that. Oops. Let's go with another Blast Forge here. Proceed to damage. What did I do? Oh, another one. What? That's cool. And another one. Alright, additional. See the damage, alright? Take that. Alright. Behemium again added. Incoming communication. What the hell do you want, Logan? So I installed this nice chat app on your slate. What do you think? 
It's not bad. It ain't I message, but hey, I'll take it. I don't give a damn. Why are there more wacko junkers in downtown Centauri? Don't know yet. These are from the city fleet. They've been working fine for ages. So the fresh out of the factory bots weren't the only ones that went screwy? Guess not. I'll look into it. I can only take one little bug right now. So we get more here. Hmm. How do I do that? Two damage. Ah, oh, yeah, I can take the Drake. Holy crap. I'll take the Drake. Two damage. Two litter bugs. Alright, got two now. Take four damage. Activating Drake sacrifices a blast forge to deal two additional damage. Which I will do. Thank you very much. Blast Forge will go with the Steel Splitter. Add that. Six damage now. Uh, let's just take all the uh, most of the litter bugs here, actually. Alright. Hell yeah. Alrighty. Uh, we got Logan here. So wait. There's something going on near building NW12 or Northwest 12. As if anything remotely interesting might be happening, Centauri. Well, look serious. You should get over there when you're done. I still got a bunch of them. Let's do this again. And I can take another Drake, actually, but I think. Ah, screw it. Let's do another Drake. Dumpster bot destroy there. I'm gonna take. I just took another Drake. More damage. 11. Alright, cool. One more scrapper, and I think we're good here. A scrapper fly. There we go. Destroy them all. So wait, you need to get to the Northwest Plaza right now. All right, I'll take the jump starter. Hang your coat. Wait, what? Hang your horses. That's fine. The jumps are personal subsonic, subsonic aircraft. Lift off. So again, what's going on? It's bad. There's a swarm of unpiloted Centauri robotics drones constructing other units. Unpiloted drones with nobody wielding them? Just building stuff on their own. Thought there was a bug flying there. Correct. Right now, they're only building more public sanitation bots, but drones can construct nearly anything. Out of control, drones are a serious threat. The whole Centauri robot robotics network go off the deep end? Perhaps. All the tasks are assigned by centralized artificial intelligence that optimizes for efficiency. Maybe it's decided to optimize urban cleanliness by chasing out all the humans. Not the humans. Ha! Huh, that's pretty unlikely with all the Alliance's AI safety laws. Well, the Alliance's dogs will be here in no time if these drones start building stuff that knows how to shoot. Looks like I'm here. We have arrived. And we're going back to battle again. I got an engineer. Drones are now available for construction. Drones require energy, which is produced by engineers. Alright, take that all. And let's go with the Blast Forge right now. Alright, so the AI is doing now. Alright. Again, steel splitter. Let's go with another blast forge here. And then I can, I can do it. Steel splitter too. Uh, All right. Steel splitter, blast forge. All right. Receive damage. One little bug. I can destroy here. But yeah, guys, again, this is available on Steam right now for early access. If you want to check it out, link below. Uh, very satisfying. <laughs> I haven't played, uh, what is it, Hearthstone ever, except for that Yu-Gi-Oh card game that I did a long time ago on Adobe World Gaming. But, dude, this is actually kind of satisfying trying to do all of this for not. Two drones destroyed. I'm going to try to take out the drones first, actually, here. Again, thank you, Lunar Studios, for letting me play your game. Appreciate it. And again, I can't wait to do and play more promotional games for other gaming companies that email me. Because I'll happily do them and I'll happily play them. Because I'm satisfied with every game so far that I have played. And now, Prismata, I love it right now. <laughs> I love it. Alright, I can get a Drake going right now. But you know what? Let's just go with another Blast Warrior Steel Splitter. And take three more drones from them. Drones are annoying. They're getting a lot of gold, actually. All right. 
So the group you're engaging appears to be the last of them. Nice. Meet me back at the bar once I'm done here then. Nah, I wanted to conduct the software autopsy on those drones. Can you grab one of their logic chips from the debris when you're done? Will do. I can find one without any holes in it. Man. I'd rather go to the bar, dude. Alright. Uh, let's go with the last four here. Four drones. I can take the Drake now. Do that. And take all the litter bugs out. There we go. Nice. Alright, they got the Drake. I know one of my friends, my co-workers will love this game. Definitely. Since he plays or it doesn't look like League of Legends most of it still. Go take out the dumpster spawn over there. I want to use the Drake. Hell yeah. Another Drake. Heck yeah. Take two. Scrap. Again, I, I don't know when to upload this, but I'll just upload it right after 5 p.m. Since I go to bed like around 7, 8-ish at night. So I hope that's the perfect time to upload this. That is it right there. Level three, right? Optional. Win by turn 18. What was my turns? Where are my turn counts? I think it's in the bottom right there, but again, oh, 20 turns. Suck. <laughs> 20 turns. I, I I didn't even uh I didn't even notice the turn count. I was uh I was I was kind of addicted right there. Uh, I I kind of lost focus. Okay. <laughs> Shit. All right, well, level three, victory. I'm going back to the bar. That was a close one. I have no idea what you're talking about. I mean, a couple more steel splitters and we will have <laughs> gone over the budget again. Maybe you, should, you shouldn't you should have blown all of her money on Giselle's upgrades. You just give her some hair, you know, at least something like that. She turned out to be pretty useful today. You should come back to the office. It's your turn to file all the reports this week. Fine. Can't really complain after getting to blow up this much stuff in one day. Go back to the bar first, you know. Ah, oh, I don't even know if we went to the bar. Well, completed. Junkers. Square wave. Again. I don't want to dwell too deep. Again. Uh, I don't know how much I can play or show or whatever. I don't know when to upload it, but I'm just going to guess that I could upload it right after 5 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Again, it says GMT. Greenwich Mean Time. Toronto. 5 o'clock p.m. But I'm just going to guess right after 5 p.m. Eastern Standard Time because I cannot upload this video after 10 p.m. Eastern Standard Time because I'm already asleep by then and I have to go to work tomorrow early in the morning. So, Prismata, I enjoyed it. I enjoyed the alpha right now of the campaign, guys. Again, it was so satisfying trying to especially swipe the cards and then attacking the uh, the enemy player with an instant. You learn so quickly with it, and that's what I love about Prismata right now. So again, the shout out and thank you to Lunark Studios on allowing me to play their early access alpha game. Again, the game is gonna be available right now on Steam. It's their first game on Steam, by the way, so congrats to Lunark Studios on putting, in, putting this and publishing it to Steam. There's a link below if you wanna check it out. And if there are more promotional games, I'm happy to play and try them out and uh, sponsor whatever I can to help them out because I love to play video games even though I haven't gotten much time. You know, I'm watching anime mostly and everything and you guys keep requesting verses and let's plays for the other games, most importantly RTS games, but you know, I like to play video games and try out new games for my channel because I am bringing more content, more games into it at World Gaming. Again, World of Warships has made the scene. Uh, what else? Again, these promotional games are also coming into it at World Gaming. And then I actually have uh, <laughs> some funny, fun games. Almost like, like some Flash games that I'm actually going to bring to World Gaming because I've always wanted to try. Are you smarter than a fifth grader? Do you want to be... I forgot what it's called, but uh, something a millionaire. 
you guys have heard of the television program before, but do you want to do you want to be a millionaire? Or maybe even some Happy Wheels if I can include that as well. So yeah, I'm trying to bring all these games where everyone, including myself, can laugh, you know, enjoy. So uh, yeah, that's what I'm trying to do for the whole game right now. In the future, it's 2018. It's about time, right? So tomorrow I'll be streaming uh, around 1 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, hopefully, and I'll be announcing that on YouTube community, Twitch. Twitter, Patron, etc, etc, for Empire Fridays. Whoever wants to show me your saves, your empires, for whatever game, just broadcast it through Steam, and I'll basically just talk over it, narrate it, and show it to everyone on Twitch, because I do like to see different empires that people have uh, built up in their games. So this is Prismata, again, Episode 1, Outbreak, Recombinations, Episode 2, Keystone, 3, Lockdown, Cleansing, that's a nice planet though, Centauri. Uh, that mission's completed too, and then I can't see that's exit right there. Okay, and then you can battle over right here. I forgot to show all this, but casual match, rank play versus computer versus friend. You can play with friends. You can play online. Leaderboard here. I'm not at top of the leaderboard. Of course, you can learn the game. You can watch games as well, live, customize. You can customize your character or your avatar as well. Select your avatar. I'm Raj right now. There's a bunch you can choose, but I like her hair color, blue, pink, I like that. I don't want to be swayed, <laughs> kind of reminds me of a Caesar show. <laughs> yeah, that's just me. So a lot of people are just streaming the game right now and I'm probably also going to be uploading videos to YouTube, but I rather prefer to upload it to YouTube because that's where most of my views and my content is at. But I will try to stream this game tomorrow if I can. Because I want to keep going and try to finish more missions for episode 1 of Prismata. So again guys, if you enjoyed it, again there's a link below if you want to check it out. It is on Steam. I'll be uploading this right after 5pm. But you guys are already going to be watching that or have already watched it. Subscribe, like, thank you Lunar Studios for letting me try out Prismata. I definitely enjoyed it and I can't wait to continue it. And I'll see you guys next time. <laughs>